Builders saw something awful in the bushes. It grabbed the cat and was getting ready to eat him. The construction crew were all familiar with Portia, the black cat, and his striped friend. While the men were grouting the foundation of the house, the cats kept wandering around them. They were hunting mice, birds, and even small snakes. The workers grew fond of the cats and even planned to take them home after the construction was over. However, no one could have expected what happened next. The workers heard a strange stifled squeak coming from the bushes, hardly recognizable as a cat's meow, and rushed to the rescue. They parted the branches and discovered an eerie sight. A huge spotted python had coiled around their pet, making several rings, and was clearly going to eat Portia for lunch. The snake had every chance of a successful meal, as pythons are exceptionally strong. They start by strangling the prey, embracing it to break its bones, and then they swallow the whole prey and retreat into the shade to digest their catch. One of the workers found long sticks nearby, which the men used as weapons. One of them pressed the python's head to the ground, holding it with a stick, and another person began to unwind the python. At the sight of the new danger, the snake released the cat from its deadly embrace and turned towards the new prey. The python opened its mouth, but fortunately the people were too tough for it, and it was restrained by the two sticks, which were pressing its flexible body to the ground. I could see in his eyes that he was alive, recalls the worker who saved the cat. The cat lay completely motionless as if dead, but people were sure that he was still alive. One of the saviors grabbed the animal by his hind legs and dragged him out of the battlefield. He gave the cat CPR as he would have done to a human in a similar situation. It looked like gentle padding, but the cat started to move. He turned his head and stood up on his shaky legs with a completely shocked expression on his face. The cat went about his cat business, and then he went to meet his striped friend. To make it easier for the animal to come out of the shock, the men put a bowl of water in front of the cat and fed him some fresh fish for dinner. They grabbed the python by the jaw and carried it away from the construction site so that no one got hurt, while the cat fortunately only suffered a scare. Bart looks like an ordinary pet even despite only having one eye and what seems like an eternal pirate grin on his face. He's chubby, shiny, and terribly cute. It's hard to believe what this cat experienced five years ago. It was literally a journey to the afterlife, under the ground and back. The black and white cat was hit by a car. They buried him in a shallow grave on the side of the road. However, five days later, Bart went back to his people. He had come to his senses, felt hungry, and literally crawled his way out of the ground. The cat zombie, as he was dubbed on social networks, looked really creepy. Bart's left eye was badly damaged as larvae had started breeding there while the cat was underground. The animal had a slit in the palate and a broken lower jaw. The resurrected pet was picked up by the Humane Society of Tampa Bay Volunteers. Real pros took care of him. They fixed the jaw with a wire, sewed up the palate, cleaned out, and removed the gunk. The eye, unfortunately, couldn't be saved. The vets dealt with dehydration and fed the unfortunate animal who couldn't eat on its own. A shelter volunteer, Valerie, took care of the cat. She literally liked Bart the instant she saw him. The former owner didn't want to give the cat away, but since he wasn't inclined to pay the huge medical bills, the shelter managed to defend their right to own the cat in court. Having improved his health, Bart went to live with the girl who took care of him. Valerie was worried about how Bart would be received by the other pets in her house. The girl already had two cats rescued from shelters at different times. However, everything went better than she could have imagined. When she brought the carrier into the house, Max, the eldest of the cats, immediately came to check it out. As soon as the owner opened the door, Bart hadn't even had time to step out of the carrier. Max was already looking inside. He licked his new friend, who was still too weak, and took him under his wing. I thought it was awfully nice. Such a warm welcome, she said. He hadn't even come out of the carrier when Max stuck his face inside and asked, How are you? Welcome and come out. At first, Bart had no clue how to play. He just looked at the toys with confusion. 
But now, after five years in a loving home, the cat has perfectly mastered a variety of toys. However, Bart adores his tailed cousins much more than his clockwork mice. His favorite games are hiding and jumping from around the corner to scare the cats, and sometimes people, or sitting on the coffee table and pawing at everyone who goes by. He certainly has the nicest disposition. He's the first to come to the door and greet anyone who enters the house. Bart's doing great. He's put on weight, feels very confident, and has thick and shiny fur. Valerie still can't believe that her cat had scratched his way out of the grave, and she admires his incredible will to live. The girl is very grateful to the shelter for having met Bart and for their help with the medical bills. She hopes that her story will attract the attention of people who care about the fate of stray cats and those who want to help the Humane Society of Tampa Bay. Now, a lot of you probably have a cat, or you might be planning on getting one. Either way, we think it'll be useful for you to know some facts about these animals. For example, a cat can express its emotions with the help of its tail. If you watch the tail, you'll notice that its position changes depending on the pet's mood. If the tail is raised up, almost vertically, it means that the cat's glad to see you and is greeting you. When the tail moves back and forth quickly, the cat is very irritated. The tail carried high above the head, typical mainly of males, means that the cat has gained an advantage over its rivals. If the tail moves slowly and chaotically, the cat's resting, but still alert. Did you know that when a cat lies down and displays its tummy, it means that it trusts you completely and allows you to gently stroke it? Whatever the situation, the animal usually aggressively protects its tummy. You can check this by stroking the cat's belly without the animal's permission. Another peculiarity is the cats find their way home without using their eyesight. This is because they acutely respond to the Earth's magnetic field. When experimental cats were exposed to strong magnets, they lost orientation and could not return home. Besides that, cats can also have a beneficial effect on the treatment of serious mental conditions, heart disorders, and brain damage caused by strokes, hemorrhages, and trauma. In the West, cats are widely used in hospitals, special education institutions for mentally disabled children, as well as in nursing homes. Tell us in the comments below what kind of pet you have and their names.